Christopher Booth, the Excellus CEO, is not the only member of the insurance crime family, Excellus, Aetna, United Healthcare, etc., shaking down the residents of New York in the United States. Excellus apparently paid 107 employees more than $200,000 a year last year for a total of nearly $12 million in salaries. With all this money being handed out, why does Excellus get nonprofit protections? Shouldn't they have their nonprofit status rescinded? Shouldn't Excellus have to play by the same rules that the rest of the business world has to play by?